Every day, I issue my wife with a menu of dinner options for that evening's meal. Oh, my <gasps> God. Wow. He's still my Whoa. beating heart. OK, I think the first thing I want to know is, how does your wife... Does your wife feel supported or does she feel pushed around? Mm. I think she quite likes it. I think she... It, it's, it's I've system. never asked her. <laughs> <laughs> she will speak when she is spoken to. <laughs> My slippers and my pipe. <laughs> 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 Look, it's been going on long enough that it, I think it's a fair assumption that she likes it. Right. Okay. Do you, Do you have any favourites? Like, are there any re repeat features? Because I know when I, ha I think I have a similar situation going on at home, I'm like, yep, I just. It's basically the same four things on rotation. Or do you have an endless stream of options? Oh, it's funny because you're saying, yeah, your partner is working so hard, and you've just let the cat out of the bag. Look, I actually pride myself. There's no repeat dishes. It, it's a new oh. set of four, four entirely new dishes every every menu. You must have very regular sexual intercourse. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That's I have a I'm menu thinking. of things she'd like to do in the yeah. bed. <laughs> <laughs> Is it printed? Printed menu, yeah? Or is it just a sort of... You know... I, I get my calligraphy pen. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, it's normally... It would be an email or a text, probably. <laughs> a, a blackboard that you do, like, little flowers on the <laughs> side and everything. I love it. I love what it. What are some of the options that you... Uh, that you, you know, just, just say one of the menus right now for us. The most recent one, for example, if I can recall, um, the four options were Syrian chicken with a rice pilaf. Oh. I'm feeling aroused. <laughs> <laughs> um, the next option would have been Ville Saltenbocca with oh. seasonal greens. Yum! Hang on, what time are you offering her these? Yeah. The menu normally gets sent out at about 3 or 4 p.m. What were the other two things on the specials? The other two, pasta a la vodka. Yum. And the fourth option on the menu was duck floater. Wow. Right. That's a lot of food that's been made from scratch from 4pm onwards, that's in your fridge, obviously had to be defrosted, a bit ready to go. That's a lot of food waste in your house, I've got to admit. Mm. I will only make the one she chooses. I mean, I yeah, haven't, what about the other stuff? I haven't done any choose? shopping at this point. Whatever she chooses will determine what I buy you from the shops. You toddle off. So, you, on a daily basis, you toddle off to the shops to buy what your wife it's would... It's an extraordinary thing, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I, I, need, I almost feel like I need that not to be true for my own, <laughs> for my own relationship. But is it? What so is that... your gut telling you? Is it mm. true or a lie? Every day. Every day? Not days that we're, that we're eating out. It would happen four or five times a week on the oh. days we're eating in. Yeah, that's, that's incredible. But you've had a very similar experience. Except, what do you think about the... I mean, your... Your fella, just like the same fucking four <laughs> meals. <laughs> round and round. Oh, God, here it comes. Whereas and he's and saying, they're all beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> Whereas he's saying... Um, different ones every single time. Mm. Does that stretch it, stretch it, the plausibility to breaking that point? That stretches or do you still... the plausibility. But, look, I, 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 might, I might not be the perfect person for this show because I'm very gullible. I'm inclined to think it's true. What, what about... What, what do you think? Well, Chris is very verbose and he's a very confident uh, public speaker, but I would have thought if I were Chris and it was the truth, I would have tried to put a couple of ums and ahs in there. But maybe red herring, against, sort of. Maybe that's against mm. his... Um, I don't know. It sounds very... I did light. put lots He's of ums and ahs in, but the editor of this show took them all out. <laughs> <laughs> We've got True here. Yeah, but now I'm second-guessing because I don't well, know. I, 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 I think you're like, we've got nothing to lose. <laughs> I, I, I'm going to go with True because I look at Chris, I think Chris is an absolute gentleman and, it, and to me it strikes me as the sort of thing that he would do. OK, well, I'm going with my team. We're yep. saying True. I cannot wait to find oh. out what this is. Chris Taylor, is that the truth or a lie? You're all invited to my place for dinner. That is true. Yay! 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 You're a lucky wife. You're a lucky wife. And I'm in the doghouse. Thanks. <laughs> it's true. Chris really does issue his wife with a menu of dinner options. That is so impressive.